All the things that we've been through You should understand me Like I understand you Hey, what's up? What the hell am I doing out in the woods here today? Came out here because it's something different. It's a beautiful day. And I wanted to add a little bit more commentary to yesterday's video, seeing how as of noon today, which means it hadn't even been posted for 24 hours, it already had over 550 views. I never expected anything like that. And all the comments and PMs and texts and everything I got last night, really unexpected. So apparently there's a lot of other people that feel the same way. And incidentally, I left the ratings on for the first time in weeks. And of course, the same people, as always, you idiot douchebags, you don't like my videos. I don't know why you torture yourself and watch them. I just find that hilarious and I dig the fact that you force yourself to at least start my video long enough to put your thumbs down on there. I'd rather you uh, consider a thumbs up your fucking ass. <laughs> Anyways, um, I want to clarify, really a point I was trying to make was simply that I'm burned out on YouTube, I made a lot of videos over the past few years, and the videos that I do watch and the time that I devote to YouTube just really aren't as fun as what they used to be. Two, three, four years ago, it used to be lots of people were doing individual box breaks, they were showing their... PC cards. There's not even that many mail days anymore. It's all people just announcing they're going on blog and announcing they're doing raffles and they got, here's my eBay listings and all that, which, you know what, you guys, is absolutely fine. Just continue to do that. That's what you want to do on here. There's no problem on my end with that and nobody else should have a problem with it. It's your prerogative. It's just that you're going to end up getting unsubscribed to because that's the approach I'm going to take from now on. And I would ask you to do the same for me. If you don't like my videos, for Christ's sake, I don't want you to be my subscriber. Unsubscribe. You dumbass. I would ass. rather have 220 solid friends on here that are my subscribers than 2,200. That number to me has really become just a farce. I don't know why I got so fired up and bought into the idea of the subscriber in the first place because it's just a joke. Um, the, the more important element of YouTube is adding someone as a friend or making friends with them. I know I've said that before. Um, so on that note, uh, it, it wasn't whining, it wasn't complaining, nothing like that, just expressing my opinion, just like everyone else has the right to do. Um, so I think this unsubscribe movement, movement should be something that other people pick up and run with because there's no point to just subscribing to someone just because they ask you to or any other list of reasons why. You should subscribe to somebody because you truly enjoy watching their videos and if you don't, then be done with it. Unsubscribe. Ass wipe. And I'd like to invite everyone who doesn't enjoy my videos, who doesn't watch them on a regular basis, who feels the need to thumbs down me, just unsubscribe. Don't torture yourself anymore for God's sake. I mean, don't you find other things more valuable to do with your time than to sit there and get pissed off over watching some guy's video that you don't like? You know, the other thing is you thumbs down a video where I've gotten cards in from somebody or where I'm giving credit to somebody. Not only, I mean, I could care less if you thumbs down me, but you're disrespecting them too, and that really makes you an asshole. So, you know, moving on. Um, I saw a cool video yesterday by Gary King of Steak, one of the guys who, throughout time, I have thoroughly enjoyed watching his videos. They're always different, they're creative, they're funny as hell. And yesterday, the return of Larry. Oh, man, I've missed Larry. And, you know, he was taking kind of a little shot at Ron, Third Mill, third mill Sports Cards, because Ron's kind of feeling the same way I am these days, and he took a little shot at me. All I can tell you, Gary, Larry, that is just 100% pure sexual frustration on your part. All right, I look at Larry, and I can see that look in his eyes. I know he's saying that stuff about me because he wants me to take him. Quite frankly, I'm going to be honest with you. Yeah. I want to feel that warm, soft puppet mouth wrapped around the base of my cock, too. I'm not going to lie. The days of pumping a tube sock are gone. I want to upgrade, man. Larry? Yeah. And Gary, you better share him, too. Right? 
I don't care what DNA you've left on that pup of yours. Just give me a shot, man. Helicopter flying over. Just share, all right? Be a good friend and share. In fact, I'm willing to trade one rusty trombone on you, Gary, for an hour with Larry. All right, enough said on that, enough said. Sit here and dream about that one for a long time. Mmm. Better than a gum job from an 85 year old woman with no teeth. But, uh, yeah, anyways, uh, final comments that were really driven yesterday by, I don't know if I was clear enough, but uh, there's been a few people that I can think of, maybe more, that came into play on YouTube came across as real collectors that thought they were, or I shouldn't say thought they were, they were trying to convince everyone that they were building relationships and becoming friends, but really it just turned out the only reason they're on here is to access a group of people to try and sell things and make money. And that became painfully apparent to a lot of us. And that's fine, if that's what you want to do, just admit it. Nobody has a problem. Uh, I mean, here's a good example of someone I'm not talking about, RBI Crew 7. This is his business. He does this to make money, and we all respect that. He's an he energetic guy. He's a personal guy. He's a likable guy. He does what he does to make some money, and he makes no bones about it, and I respect that. But it's the people that try and cover themselves under the veil of, oh, I'm your friend. I want to develop a relationship with you. I want to be buddies, you know, whatever it is, and then you find out that all they really want to do is sell things on there or link you to their eBay auctions or whatever you know what we're not stupid no we're not but anyways uh, I better get up from here I think I've said enough for now grab the camera off the tree hanging it there and uh, start heading back beautiful day here today loving it There's something else I want to show you so everything's cool, you know, like I said, I'm just a little burned out on YouTube. I've been making videos for a long, long time and I make a lot of them. And i got to find other more productive things to do with my time. Warm weather's here, my spring sports are here. Summertime, we're going to do some fishing. What up, Denny? Uh, you know, that's just the way it's going to be. Where was it that I saw that on the way in here? Something was looking really, really good to me. Where is it? Damn it. I'll find it. Oh yeah, check this out. Mm. I don't think that's gonna work. It's not wide enough. It's gonna cause some chafing too. Ah shit. I really wanted some of that. <laughs>